Because all I got to say is the website looking real skinny. Hey babes, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shaylin and in today's video, I'm bringing you babes a collective haul now baby. If you don't know what a collective haul is, you probably shouldn't be watching this video. You should probably be reading the book. Go ahead and stimulate them brain cells, sis. I will see you next time, okay? But I gathered together all of the things that I've picked up recently. If you guys don't know, your girl is a shopaholic. I like to dibble and dabble in all things, okay? So we got shoes, we got clothes, we got bags, we got sunglasses, baby. I got it all, okay? Now, if you are tuned into the vlogs, some of these items may not be new to you, girl. And shout out to you for being a real one. And shout out to you because you got the links of first. Now, Susie in the back, if you mad that something sold out, Susie, I don't feel bad for you, baby. Tune into the vlogs and the next time, you know, you won't miss out, okay? But before we go ahead and jump into today's video, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Also, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so you don't miss an upload. But without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So the first category that I wanna get into with you babes is sunglasses. Y'all know your girl loves sunglasses at this point. Point, I really should not be buying any more sunglasses but I don't know something about sunglasses for me just elevates your look it can give a whole different vibe okay so the sunglasses that I want to share with you babes are from Giant Vintage y'all know they are my go-to for sunglasses okay especially when I want that Y2K 90s type of vibe so I picked these up right here I picked these up for a specific occasion I'm not sure what these are called but I will have everything on screen and linked down below. But I picked these up because I thought I was gonna wear them to the Chris Brown Little Baby concert. I decided to get rid of that outfit so I didn't wear them. However, comma, they are still very cute. They are giving very much so Barbie. I actually think these are called Barb's. I don't have a pink a pair of sunglasses and these are just so gorgeous. So they are basically that very see-through type of sunglass vibe. I think these will look so cute on vacation or even on a nice like summer day when you wanna look super sporty. Um, so absolutely love these. One thing I love about Giant Vintage is their sunglasses are so affordable. If you are looking for a pair of sunglasses that are cute, trendy, but you don't wanna break the bank, 100% recommend checking out Giant Vintage Sunglasses because baby, I probably have at least 10 to 12 pairs of sunglasses from them and I love every single pair. The next pair of sunglasses that I wanna share with you babes are a bit of a splurge. Okay, your girl got these on sale. I've talked about these a ton on my channel but I don't believe I've shared them in a collective haul. So I wanted to share them with you again because they are just my prize possessions. Like these are my favorite sunglasses to date and they are these Bottega Veneta sunglasses. They are just your gorgeous classic black sunglasses and when I tell you guys I don't know if it's my face shape or it's just these sunglasses in general but they look so good on me like a lot of the time sunglasses I just feel like they're not quite right for my face shape but I feel like these are perfect they just look so good on I don't want to mess up my makeup but I have to show y'all like what I immediately look expensive like immediately i absolutely adore these sunglasses they are definitely more so my vibe i feel like they're very much so cool girl relaxed but still elevated um the gold on the side i think really helps to make these sunglasses look a bit more elevated a bit more chic i love these sunglasses you guys i wear them all the time i wear them when i'm wearing sweatshorts I wear them if I'm dressing up. Girl, they are just a vibe and they are the classic black color. I actually wanna pick these up in the white shade as well. I gotta put these in the box properly, okay? Cannot afford to mess these up. So the next category that I wanna get into with you babes are bags. Your girl has been buying quite a few bags lately. I really feel like I didn't have that many bags. I felt like I was always the type of person that when I came to an outfit, I was always like, Oh, I wish I had a bag like this. I wish I had a bag like that. So I've really been picking up bags. Of course, I have my eyes on a few designer bags, but I really like to sit with a designer bag before I purchase. Just because, girl, designer bags are not cheap and to have something that you thought you liked but really is trendy and you only like it because everybody else likes it, eh, not my vibe, okay? So I definitely have some designer dupes here to share with you, babe. so let's get into it. The first little dupe that I have is this bag from H&M. This is sort of like a Balenciaga inspired type of bag, definitely with the long flaps. This reminds me of the Balenciaga Neo Classic. It's in this like Bottega green color, which is 
very very trendy we know this color has been super popping this whole season then you have also like these long tassels so it's balenciaga inspired but it's not exactly trying to duplicate that bag if that makes sense but still definitely gives you the same look and same vibe so absolutely love this bag also comes with like a cross body strap if you want to wear it cross body i probably won't really wear mine cross body honestly i'll probably just mainly wear it like this but super cute bag definitely giving balenciaga vibes i think this bag is sold out on h&m but i saw that it's supposed to be coming back in stock so make sure you guys sign up for the notification so that way you can get notified or check your local h&m because i was able to snag mine in store the next bag is also from h&m h&m has been baby H&M has been eating the designers up, okay? They said, y'all want to charge this price? Okay, we're going to do something similar and charge this price, okay? And I am here for it. Again, we have another Balenciaga dupe. As y'all can see, Balenciaga is just... It really has a hold on me. It really has a hold on me. I'm not going to lie. So I picked up this bag, which is definitely similar to the Le Kegel. I hope I'm saying that right. Bag. Look at me. I hope I'm saying that right, girl. How you gonna want a bag you can't even pronounce? Ah, I don't care. I still want it. But anyways, so I got this bag. I absolutely have been loving silver bags lately. For one, I've been really getting into silver jewelry. And for two, I just feel like a silver bag is something that will always go with everything. So pretty much if I'm wearing like silver accessories, I can wear a silver bag and same with a gold bag. So I definitely want to get a gold bag. But to me personally, it's really hard to find gold and silver bags that don't look cheap this one to me is like borderline <laughs> like right it looks cheap up close but from afar it looks pretty decent okay so just keep that in mind mind you guys this purse was only like 24 dollars. yeah it was 24.99 so just keep that in mind this strap is adjustable so you can kind of adjust it to fit whatever length you want you can wear it as a shoulder bag or you can wear it as a cross body bag. But absolutely love this bag. Definitely a super cute dupe. I'm actually going to be doing a designer dupes video very, very soon for you guys. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you stay tuned and turn on your post notification. Y'all know I'm a Bottega girl, so I had to pick me up a little Bottega dupe. And boom, here she is. I have to give all credit to Miss Cake for this purchase, okay? Like... She found this. It is so cute, you guys. I love the size. I was able to find clutches in this color, but the size was always too big. But I absolutely love, love this. Again, to me, it's like in between looking expensive and cheap. Like, you know what I mean? Like, if you look at it too hard, <laughs> it looks cheap. If you look at it from afar, it looks expensive. But it still gives you that Bottega pouch type of vibe. I absolutely love this bag. It's so cute. I wish they would come out with this in gold because baby I would snag it. So Express, please, please come out with this in gold if you ever see this video because the girls need it. Okay. It does come with a strap if you guys want to wear it like crossbody. Not my vibe. So that's why she's tucked in. And it does come with another little like detailed chain strap if you want to wear that on the outside. But me personally, that makes it not look like Bottega. So I don't wear that. But love this little pouch, perfect for nights out, weddings, any sort of like fancy event, perfect for that. So absolutely love, love, love this pouch. Girl, I'm gonna keep pulling this top up. Don't ask me where this top is from because it is so annoying. It keeps going down. Literally, once I wear it in this video, I'm getting rid of it because it's throwing me off, okay? But I wanted to talk about this next bag, which is from Target. So it is like this kind of woven pattern bag. Very beachy, very much summer. I saw this in Target and literally picked it up and y'all, it rung up for like $12. And I was like, or was it seven? Girl, I don't know, it was low, okay? This is so freaking cute. It's very beachy. It's just like a clutch and it's very large and you can kind of fold it over and like carry it like this. Super cute. Absolutely obsessed with this. I saw that it was sold out online. So definitely search your targets because I found mine in store. So the next item that I want to share with you guys is not necessarily a bag, but it's something that you can use in your tote bag. So I have my Goyard tote. If you guys have any type of tote, whether it be a Goyard, a Neverfull, 100% recommend a bag organizer. Now my bag is empty. I took everything out, but usually this bag is just wide open, no pockets, no compartments. And literally every time I reach in it to find something, I can never 
find it so I decided to go on Amazon saw that they had these little bag organizers now I'm not gonna lie it took me a minute like I had to keep buying and returning buying and returning because the sizing chart was like a little bit off um so just keep that in mind but luckily Amazon does free returns but this way you can compartmentalize everything tote bags are great because you can fit so much stuff but terrible because when you need to find something you have to dig through it and I hate being that girl I also like that it gives the bag a structure so when I sit it down it doesn't like just flop it kind of still maintains that structure so if you have a tote bag I definitely 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 recommend getting a tote organizer from Amazon so let's go ahead and jump into the next category which is shoes so the first pair of shoes that I want to get into is a pair of sandals if you follow me on TikTok then you saw me do a TikTok on these sandals y'all if you want the Hermes Orion sandals definitely give these a try a, they are only $13, yes, $12.99, and they just go with everything. Are they super comfortable? No, it's like a flat sandal, very basic, very simple, okay? But from what I hear, girl, Hermes is giving the same thing, okay? And they ain't charging $13. But yeah, I absolutely love these. I also have these in the nude pair, and I recently picked them up in black. I wear these all the time. They're just such a cute slip-on sandal. I find myself always, like, not really having sandals that I can throw on that aren't super casual. So I love having these. I feel like they're dressy enough to wear in the office, but casual enough to wear them, like, on the weekends if I just want to throw them on, go run errands or something like that. So I absolutely, absolutely love these sandals. If they come out with them in more colors, baby, I'm copping them. Because $13, baby, you cannot beat it. Definitely check your H&M if your size is sold out. Because every time I go into H&M, they always have these in stock. So yeah, love them. Get these, get the new ones, baby, get them all. I'm so excited for this next item. It is a pair of sneakers. Now, if you guys don't know, I'm from the DMV. And this is such a DMV sneaker. I never thought that I would like this sneaker. But I do. Your girl's style has changed so much. And I think I'm more so into a very classic, chunky type of sneaker. I wanted a pair of these so bad. But girl, the resale prices on these were ridiculous. So when I saw they came out out with another pair in the classic gray color girl I snagged them now I did order them from like a UK website which is completely fine it's a legitimate website so if you guys want to use them definitely check it out these are them they are so gorgeous for one it is a gray sneaker that you can just pretty much pair and wear with any and everything. I just love the silhouette of this particular New Balance. Most New Balances I don't like. I do like the 550s. I definitely want to get a pair of those as well. But I just love these. I just feel like this is a classic sneaker. Especially if you live on the East Coast. Like, baby, everybody on the East Coast got a pair of these. Like... <laughs> I, I'm I'm the oddball. This is a DMV shoe. I don't care what nobody says. It's a DMV shoe. I feel like the DMV put these shoes on. Mainly DC, okay? But yeah, absolutely love these sneakers. Super comfortable. Ugh, they're just so cute. And I picked them up in a grade school size. If you guys don't know this by now, if you wear women's sizes, please go for a grade school size. You can save money that way. So like, for example, for me in women's, I wear a six. So in grade school, I get a four and a half. I can fit a four. I just prefer a four and a half for that extra toe room just in case I want to go in with a thicker sock. Next pair of shoes shocked me and disappointed me at the same damn time, okay? I got something to say about the Adidas Confirmed app. I don't like y'all. Actually, I can't blame y'all. Maybe I should blame FedEx, okay, baby? Because it's funny how... I get FedEx packages all the time. It's funny how when I hit on a pair of Yeezys, they get lost. Not even get lost. They got damaged. First of all, how do you know my package is damaged unless you opened it? How do you how do you know what's inside is damaged? Please let me know. How? Like, if my boss got a dent, still send it to me. Okay? Like, what? Ugh. Baby, that pissed me off. So I actually hit on the Onyx foam runners. And then somehow FedEx decided that it was damaged and decided that they were going to trash it. I don't believe y'all trashed it. I want to see receipts. I want to see pictures. I don't believe y'all. 
And basically the Adidas confirmed app just refunded me my money, which was so disappointing because I'd rather have those sneakers. But then shortly after that, I think because they like rigged it for me to hit, I was able to hit on the mineral blue foam runners. I would prefer the Onyx ones, but girl, beggars can be choosers, okay? So I picked these up. The mineral blue ones are kind of like a navy blue type of color. If you don't have a pair of foam runners, I feel bad for you because these are the most comfortable shoe. When I tell y'all my sand foam runners are ran down, they're ran all the way down because I just wear them so much. They go with everything. They're so comfortable. I don't care what nobody says about these shoes. You can say they ugly. You can say they alien shoes. I like them. I'm gonna wear them and they comfortable. Okay, period. I do size up in these. I do get a size five. I'm usually a size four and a half, but when it comes to foam runners and easy slides, I do get a size of five. The confirmed app still owes me a few hits in my opinion. So hopefully y'all see more Adidas boxes in the future videos because I'm still very much disappointed about my other foam runners even though it happened like two months ago okay babes and the next pair of sneakers is a rebuy and it is a pair of air force ones if you don't have a pair of air force ones let me get specific baby because not all air force ones be given if you don't have a pair of low top white air force ones what are you doing okay because these are the only sneaker in my opinion that you need when anybody ever asks me like what is like the number one sneaker or what sneaker would you recommend to start your sneaker collection these okay they go with everything and they are really really affordable please upgrade them we don't need you wearing the same pair for for 45 years i don't care how much you clean it how much you bleach it how much you watch the tiktok tutorials on how to wash the shoestrings baby get you a new pair <laughs> okay just get you a new pair okay so these are them i have worn them once so they're not like as crispy but I wore them to the Chris Brown Little Baby concert. And as you guys can see, they're still in really good condition. Me personally, I usually take really good care of my sneakers. So usually my Air Force Ones last me a decent amount of time. But yeah, super cute, super affordable, and just literally go with any and everything. So let's go ahead and now jump into the clothing items that I picked up. So the first company brand that I want to talk about is Girlfriend Collective. Now I did want to let you guys know they did send me these items items however comma this video is not sponsored okay baby and even if it was y'all still gonna get the same response from me okay so i wanted to show you guys what i picked up from them because i feel like a lot of people don't talk about this brand but they have really high quality basics so I think it's more of an athleisure brand, but don't quote me on that. But I picked up this top, which is kind of like a one shoulder bra top, crop top type of situation. But this is so cute. I think this looks really cute with a pair of sweatshorts. I never wear it with jeans, just not my style, not my vibe. But definitely in a more casual way with like some leggings or something like that to go out and run errands. I love that this fabric is stretchy yet compressive. It really sucks you in. Honestly, this feels like something you could work out in. I might test that out. I haven't, but it's just super cute, super flattering. I feel like it helps to also smooth out like your back rolls. I'm not sure how much this was, but like I said, I will have everything on screen and also everything linked down below if you guys wanted to pick any of these items up. And the next top that I got from them is this black sort of razor top. Now this is a ribbed material. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's like a ribbed material. Super cute. Again, still really thick and compressive, which I love you guys. Like this material is insane. Again, a top you can work out in or just throw on to like run errands. Um, I absolutely love having tops like this because me personally, I am going to try to push myself to pull myself together every day and having items like this to throw on really make that easy. So I absolutely love this top. And of course it's in black cause your girl loves a black like, oh, and it's such a cute top. I absolutely love this. The next top from Girlfriend Collective is definitely my favorite top by far from them. Cause it is just so a flattering Girlfriend Collective. If you see this, y'all can run me this top in a few more colors. Okay, baby. So it is this top. I believe this is called the Paloma top. And this top is so gorgeous. For one, the neckline, beautiful. Again, compressive, makes the girls look amazing, smooths out all the back rolls, baby. I love this top. It is gorgeous. Okay, I feel like it's a top that you can dress down or dress up. I will pop up a video on screen or a picture on screen showing you guys how I was able to 
dress this top up to like wear out for like a casual lunch date or something like that oh my god girlfriend collective i'm super impressed i honestly want to go back and like try their leggings because baby this material a1 okay and one thing i love about them and their website there are all body types on their website so if you maybe don't have a super athletic body or girl you got rolls they got girls on there showing what it looked like on a regular degulate body okay and i love that for us so absolutely love girlfriend collective for that and baby if y'all want to send your girls some more stuff up, baby y'all know where to find me so the next item is super random okay y'all know i'm an aritzia girl long story short this top is from aritzia it is probably the only thing that i don't like from aritzia to date and i think that's because i don't know if it's the material or maybe i should have got a smaller size but girl this top keeps falling down is so annoying but anyways i went into aritzia and picked up this gorgeous slip skirt it was actually on sale when i picked it up i think it might still actually be on sale on their website but the way this slip skirt fits you guys gorgeous i picked this up in a size eight i just love that it accentuates your body like it has like this sort of like jawstring that makes it stretchy so if you are a curvy girl perfect for us so it fits you tightly on your waist but also like accentuates the butt like it just looks so gorgeous i love the way this fits i feel like this is an item that you can dress up and wear on a girl's night out or you can also wear this to work i've worn it to work with a black bodysuit girl this is super cute i absolutely love this i might even wear it to work tomorrow because it ain't seen the light of day in a minute okay because the legs were not shaved but now the legs are shaved baby okay so i might wear this to work tomorrow but absolutely love this skirt it's super comfortable super breathable and just it's so freaking flattering like i don't know how this is cut but it is super flattering on the body so the next item that i want to share with you babes is from spanx and this is also an item that was gifted to me from them as well and it is this a bodysuit i wanted to show it to you guys because to me this is a wolfer dupe, okay? Like, I feel like it's very in to wear shapewear outside, and baby, I'm loving it. Ain't nothing better than being able to be out in public and look snatched, okay? Shapewear is supposed to snatch you, so baby, I'm happy we, we wearing it out in public. I like this trend, okay? I don't care what nobody says. But I want to share this bodysuit with you guys because it, to me, is a Wolford dupe. Now, granted, this bodysuit is not super cheap. I believe this bodysuit is like, 100 and the wolford one is like 250 so it is a bit of a savings but it's still more expensive but i absolutely love this one because again it has like the bra cups like the wolford and it does give you that smoothing effect all the way down and then the back of it is like a clasp so i think the wolford one might be a little different than this but this is sort of like a typical bra clasp and i like that because it helps to like really push the girls up and if you wanted to you can actually take the straps off of this and wear it strapless as well but i want to share it with you guys because i feel like this could be really cute with like some black trousers or some jeans throw it on with a cute heel and boom you're good to go so absolutely love this i'm tired of the tiktok girls coming for girls that are wearing shapewear outside yes we're doing it yes we love it and it seems like you're hating on it the next item that i want to share with you babes i actually don't have because it is in the washing machine but it's actually this dress that i picked up from meshki this dress is gorgeous i picked this up specifically to wear to a wedding i wore it to my best friend's wedding um if you guys know my god kids because y'all ask me all the time do i have kids baby those are my god kids they like my kids but they ain't my kids okay you know what i'm saying <laughs> i'm gonna pop up pictures on screen of me wearing this dress girl these didn't even make to the gram just because i didn't like the background i may still post them and if i do y'all better act like y'all ain't seen it before but i love this dress from meshki i did size up in this dress i got it in a large which was a good decision sorry y'all my camera stopped recording but if i was to have gotten this dress a bit sooner well i did get it sooner i didn't try it on in time i would have definitely got the back tailored a little bit because it was a large to me it was a little bit bigger than it needed to be like on the sides and in my bust area but the butt fit perfectly so just keep that in mind if you are like me where you don't have as much boobs but you do have a butt definitely size up because the material is not stretchy and then you would have to kind of get it tailored to your specific body type but I absolutely love this dress it's very classy and sexy at the same time so i wanted to share that with you babes even though she in a washing machine baby because she dirty dirty 
okay it rained on that wedding day the bottom is all muddy i ain't about to pull her out because that's embarrassing it's embar are you embarrassed so the next item that i want to get into with you babes is another dress and this is from a newer brand this is from the brand with jean now i picked up this dress for a specific event if you guys didn't know i went to an influencer event my first ever influencer event thank y'all so much because without y'all i wouldn't be having opportunities like this so thank y'all but i wanted to share with you guys the dress that i was going to wear but it did not come in time annoying okay now i was very weary of this brand because i was not sure if they were curvy girl friendly because all the girls i saw wearing these dresses were sticks straight up and down okay nothing wrong with that that's just not my body type and i was very curious because i thought this dress was super classy and sexy and sophisticated so i was just curious and i just knew if it looked good then i would love it so it is basically the most basic a strapless dress it does have like this fold over detail which kind of gives it like that tuxedo kind of vibe and it has like this boning in it. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but it kind of gives it like a corset look at the top. It goes in at the top and then out at the bottom. Super cute, super classy. The only thing with this dress, y'all, it is short. So if you are tall and you have a butt, leave this on the website, baby, okay? Because I'm like a couple inches away from everything hanging out. I did consider returning this dress just because I did feel like it was so short. And then also for the price point, I wasn't super wowed by it. I need to start reading these websites policies. So basically, if you use the discount code, you can't return it unless you get store credit. And I'm like, why would I want store credit? Like, it don't fit. Like, why would I want to buy something else from your website that's not going to fit right? But that's my fault, girl, for not reading the fine print. So just keep that in mind if you do shop with them, that if you use the discount code, girl, you ain't getting your money back. Okay, so I decided to keep it just because I spent so much money on it or whatever so it's still a really cute dress i think once i drop a few more pounds i'll like it a little bit better so yeah super cute dress picked it up in a size large and yeah she's short short as hell but guess what i'm aware because i didn't pay for it okay and the last dress that i want to share with you babes is from a brand called Tordrobes, which is black owned i have wanted to shop this brand for ever i finally 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 was able to snag one of their items this came in stock and girl i was on it okay baby because you cannot sleep on their drops so it is this dress right here i know this is probably gonna mess with the lighting but it is this white dress and then it has like this boning on the back it is so nice and thick you guys like this is quality like i can tell this was not cheaply made the zippers are really nice as well they're like little skulls y'all this dress gives one thing i love about this dress is you're able to control how much skin you show so like the zippers you have the ability to zip it undone if you want to show a little bit more boob action or you can zip it back up I only have one hand so i love the versatility of this the fabric of this dress amazing definitely a type of fabric that you can size down in me personally i went for a medium because i wanted it to fit but i didn't want it to fit too tight because sometimes i feel like when stuff fits too tight it just accentuates the fupa even more girl and that's what we're not trying to give over here okay but i absolutely love this dress it's so gorgeous it has their branding on the bottom here y'all know i love me a good black owned clothing brand now i don't think you can purchase these because they sold out however i do believe she has pre-order available so 100 percent recommend girl this dress is gorgeous high quality i cannot wait till she restocks her tank tops like this because i'm definitely 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 gonna pick it up because this quality a1 okay babes, so the next brand that i want to get into with you babes is local european again another black owned brand that i love and adore okay so they had a recent drop and i had to pick up some of their items so the first item that i picked up is like this sort of asymmetric is it asymmetric girl it's like a squiggle okay <laughs> this sort of asymmetric top from them i love basics and i love ones that are a little bit different and i've never seen a basic like this you know you get the basic one shoulder but i've never seen one that's like cut out at the bottom like this so i thought this was super cute again the material is super nice super thick definitely wouldn't wear a bra with this would more so go for nipple covers because i do feel as though 
without nipple covers, you can definitely see my areola, okay? And that's not what I'm trying to give, but I absolutely love this top. I'm actually thinking about going back and getting it in black because it is so cute. And I feel like you can never have too many of these basic tops. You can pair them with pretty much anything, sweatpants, sweatshorts, trousers, girl cargo pants. So absolutely love this. I did pick it up in a size medium. So absolutely love this top, super cute and a great basic to have. So the next item is also from Local European and it is a pair of cargo pants. When I saw these cargo pants on the website, girl, I knew I had to have them, okay? I did order these before and I don't know why in my mind I would ever order an extra small small but they fit they just weren't giving the vibe i wanted i prefer more of a baggy relaxed fit so i definitely exchanged them but y'all these are so cute for one i love this like sage green color i'm so ready for fall and these definitely give me like fall vibes like these are the perfect pants to wear transitioning from summer to fall because they're super lightweight the color is perfect i also love that these pants are super adjustable so you can adjust the bottom if you want them to be more snug you can adjust the waist to be more tight i also love a utility look so i love that these pants have all of these like pockets on them these pants are just so cute you guys you can adjust them to wear them however you want to if you want to wear them low-waisted you can if you want to wear them high-waisted you can because they have this drawstring that allows you to control it so this will look really cute with the white top i showed you i could even wear this with like a black top a gray top i just feel like these pants literally go with everything this is a color that goes with everything and one thing i love about these pants is they're not too long typically when i get pants from brands that's like my biggest concern is that they're too long they do give me like a bagginess bunchiness at the bottom but they're not overly long okay which i absolutely love so these are super cute i'm hoping that they bring these out in more colors i love local european cargos baby they know how to do a cargo for the girls and the next two items that i want to share with you babes are from a brand called grind like a doll which is another black owned brand y'all know your girl loves to support black owned brands so they actually sent me these swim suits over so i wanted to share them with you guys so the first one that they sent over is this one piece a swimsuit in this beautiful like blue color it has like all these cutouts and one thing i love about grind like a doll they advertise their items on all body types okay i'm so tired of brands only showing items on one body type and it's like if that's not my body type how am i supposed to know if i like it like how okay so i absolutely love that about them they're super inclusive this color is gorgeous okay next vacation baby this this is popping out okay because we need her now they did send me this in a size large which i do feel like is a tad bit big definitely would go for a size medium so if you're my body type definitely would recommend a size medium but it's super cute super gorgeous definitely like a high cut on the sides and it is a little bit more cheeky so just keep that in mind um, if you're not a cheeky girl, then maybe this swimsuit isn't for you, but the next one definitely will be. So the next swimsuit they sent over is in this gorgeous orange color. Oh my God, this is so pretty, you guys. I love this color on my skin, especially when I have a tan. Again, they sent me this in a size large, but I definitely would go for a medium just because it has a little bit of too much extra space in the back for my liking. But this one does have a bit more coverage in the back as opposed to the other swimsuit. Again, Again, still a very high cut swimsuit. I love that the swimsuit is also adjustable. So it does have straps that you can use to adjust it to make sure it fits your bust perfectly. But I absolutely love this swimsuit, you guys. High quality, super cute swimsuits. And honestly, Grind Like a Doll is super affordable in my opinion. And like I said, we need to start supporting brands that support us. Support brands that put up models that look like you. Okay, stop supporting these brands that put up models that don't look like you. I'm talking, I'm saying that, and I bought from with Jean, okay? Because all I gotta say is, the website looking real skinny. Okay, babes, so those are all of the items that I picked up recently. If you babes enjoyed this video, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, leave me a comment down below and let me know which item was your favorite. And if you like any of these items or want to shop any of these items, make sure to check the description box down below. But I love you babes so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!